Hey, how do you there again, folks? Me again, of course, Brandon Wenzel. Come back at you. Another offering off my sampler platter. Yes, indeed, folks. I am Platter Video, a series of videos I've been doing for a little while. Now we're going over there to grab food and drink items. I eat stuff and drink stuff, and I talk about stuff like you know all that you need to know about. Snacks and foods and things and stuff that you're not really supposed to eat because it's bad for you and you're supposed to be an adult, but maybe you're not that great of an adult. Or maybe you're a really great adult, but you still want to know. You've still got that burning desire to know. Well, that's what I'm here for, folks. I got a Peter Can Thunderbolt poster. I got a cool Pac-Man shirt. I'm over there. I got a hamster set up off to the side. I'm clearly a professional. This is what I. This is what I'm here for, folks. I'm here to let you know about the stuff. What stuff am I here to let you know about, folks? Well, continuing off my box of crap that I bought online not that long ago with a whole bunch of snacks and stuff. Cream savers, I had some fancy Twix, uh, some Kit Kats. I just did some uh, some Doritos that were interesting. Uh, so we're going to continue on. By the way, watch all those videos. Plus, watch all my other videos. Why not? Well, folks, boom! We've got Walker's Max Kentucky Fried Chicken flavored chips. Look, it's the Colonel. Oh, folks, it's the Colonel. I think I'm just old enough, maybe, to remember, like, the commercials with the Colonel. I could be lying to myself, though, because, like, maybe that's just one of those things where, like, I've seen the commercials, you know, otherwise. I kind of remember those from being a kid. So, yeah, uh, Walker's Kentucky Fried Chicken flavored chip. I don't understand why these don't exist here already in America. You would think they would. Um... I think Walker's is like the international thing for Lay's, if I'm not mistaken, like here in the good old U.S., because it looks very similar to the logo. Walker's Max, the irresistible deep ridge crisp bursting with delicious KFC flavor for the ultimate taste explosion in every bite. KFC flavor max satisfaction. No artificial preservatives, no MSG, no artificial flavor. Yeah, doesn't, none of that matters to me. Um... Yeah, so it's Kentucky Fried Chicken Chips. I don't... Again, I don't understand why... Why wouldn't KFC put these out? Why wouldn't Lay's put these out here? I really don't know. Like, I think it's Lay's that they do, like, the... I know I've done them in the past, where they do, like, the, the different flavors that they come out with every year and stuff. Why not just do a, a run of fast food ones, too? KFC and Burger King and McDonald's and stuff. I don't understand why. Lots of things that I try, I'm like, okay, I understand why these are. <laughs> why aren't these just things? I don't know. Try some to small bag. Small bag. And and I'm guessing like with the Doritos, I can feel it now. Doesn't feel like there's very many chips in there. Yeah. What look, look, look at this crap. Seriously, folks, that's come on now. Half the bag is nothing. One day I will go over there and I will tell my grandchildren of a time before time when chips actually filled the damn bag, or at least came somewhat close to it. I mean, not 100%, that would be ridiculous, but by the time we get to the point where I'm over there and I'm recanting tales to my fictional grandchildren, you're going to get, like, three fucking chips. and it's Each chip is going to be individually bagged, and that it'll cost, like, $10 a damn chip. Let's eat some goddamn potato chips. The question is, does this have all of the all of the, the proper, spi you know, herbs and spices? You know. I can see what they're going for with it. Um, yeah, I, I, I can actually get that. Um, hmm. So it's not, 
It's not like overwhelmingly KFC flavored. Um, I don't know if that would be the first thing my, my brain would go to if I didn't know. But having the association, I can immediately tell. I maybe would have gone for a little bit more of a punchy flavor. But you can sort of, it does have sort of a KFC, you know, flavoring. So I imagine they went over there and used the KFC spice blend or some equivalent to go over there and season it. So it's evocative of it. Um, obviously, you're not really getting much of a chicken flavor. But you're getting, like, you know, the fried chicken flavor of, you know, the outside and stuff like that. Herbs and spices and stuff. Hmm. Yeah, I mean... They're not bad. I, I will say, if they were going to release these here... I would maybe tweak the recipe a little bit for the American audience. I think maybe we would like a little bit more, a little bit more flavor to it. Because it's there, and it's not bad by any means, but, because I know they're, like, you know, like Lay's had, like, a chicken and waffle flavor uh, potato chips at one point, which were fantastic. They should have won. Fucking bacon, mac, and cheese won. Bitch, they already have fucking goddamn uh, chips that are real similar to that. That was such a waste. Um, plus, I think they had Tapatio chips, which eventually we do, we do have Tapatio chips, too. Uh, but man, those those chicken and waffle ones are fantastic. Um, so I think they could do with maybe a little bit more, maybe punching up the chicken flavor a little bit. But, yeah, these are pretty good. I mean, they're not going to go over there and give you a proper KFC fix, but for being what they are, it's not bad. I just noticed something up here on the top. It says, <laughs> multi-bag, or multi-pack bag, not for individual sale. That means that this originally came in one of those big boxes full of chips. Someone took them out and sold them to my stupid ass. Yeah. Whatever. They are not bad. They're not mind blowing or anything like that, but they are interesting enough. Like I, I, I can be fairly certain in saying I don't think I've had a chip that tastes exactly like it. If you enjoy some KFC, it's it flavors. It's got some flavor to it. Um, only problem is that I like KFC. But I like Popeyes better. <laughs> Granted, there's certain things that I like from KFC more than I like from Popeyes. But I mean, I would be more excited if these were Popeyes flavored chips. But like I said, for what they are, they're they're good. I'm eating them anyway. Um, it's also good I haven't had lunch yet. But they're pretty good. Yeah, I mean. Would I recommend them? If you can run into them, like in an import store or something like that, yeah, by all means, give them a shot. Would I go out of my way to find them? No. Um, I'd wait until KFC or Laser, whoever goes over there and brings them over here properly and probably adjusts the flavor a little bit or something. But they're decent for what they are. Yeah, I can go with that. So... Give them like a six and a half out of ten. Because for some reason I have a rating system now. Anyway, folks, that's going to do it for me. Uh, if you could, get out of my teeth. Yeah, that one's just in there. Anyway, five things before I get out of here, folks. Have yourself a spectacular rest of your day, stupendous rest of your week, monumental rest of your month, amazing rest of your year. If you could go over there and have yourselves a max rest of your life that'd be pretty nifty i mean like i said 6.5 still doing better than average but you know i think we can do better than that folks but anyway file two things for me folks good try to bring some positivity in the world it's not always possible it is however always appreciated even if it doesn't always feel like it I promise it is but what if you can't do that sometimes you can't do it i know i can't do it all the time try not to be an asshole folks I think that's doable, right? It's pretty doable. 
But hey, you're going to slip up, right? I slip up sometimes. Sometimes I'm an asshole. People are going to be able to be like, Brandon, I saw this one time you were a dickbag. Yeah, you know, I, hey, man, so I try not to be, but, you know, everybody has their days. It happens. But I try to mitigate the level of assholishness in my life. I think you can do that too, folks. Final thing for me, folks, do the thing. Whatever the thing is for you, let's petition Popeyes to get some Popeyes chicks. Or Popeyes chips. Come on, man. Let's, let's, come on. We've already got the chicken sandwich wars. I have a whole playlist devoted to that, by the way. Go watch those videos. We're moving on from that, folks. We're moving into the next dimension. We're moving into the chicken chip wars. I'll take my billion dollars right now, folks. I will, I'll take it and I'll do amazing, incredibly just ridiculous things with it. Give me a billion dollars. Or don't. Probably don't. <laughs> I'd waste it. Anyway, folks, that's going to do it for me. Bye.